South Park on PS1. Dear God, why? Well, it's faithful to the show. Because you can't see anything in the third dimension. Turkeys have invaded the town. And it's not really an issue? The Seismic Center is under attack from mad robots. Are you fucking kidding me? No wonder these robots are so weak. It says made in South Park on them. No wonder these robots are so weak. It says made in South Park on them. No wonder these robots are so weak. No wonder these robots are so weak. No wonder these robots are so weak. It says made in South Park on them. It says made in South Park on them. It says made in South Park on them. No wonder these robots are so weak. No wonder these robots are so weak. It says made in South Park on them. This label that Cartman can somehow see from this distance is bullshit. They're not weak at all. This is tedious as fuck. We battle aliens on their mothership. This was a good level. He did it! Holy shit! The eerie sci-fi soundtrack and subdued colors immediately create a tense atmosphere as you progress through a series of rooms, each with their own challenge. Weaving through a maze of crates and battling the aliens raining fire atop, cows rushing you from nowhere, forcing quick thinking, is constantly surprising you, never dwelling on anything too long, like, yeah. Uh, then, a boss battle against the Mothership's core. Given what led up to it, this is promising. I don't know why I bother. There's killer toys now! Or something. Whatever! Fuck you! They all die in two hits. This is gameplay of the final level. Somehow, it got worse. So after picking Stan as my character, to the anger of poorly cropped JPEG Kenny, we get into the gameplay. What bovine body part is used to make glue? What's the most common Ashman substitute? Odd Connie co-starred in what 50s sitcom? What the hell is this? Ah, uh, remember that iconic South Park scene where Cartman learned about the formation of the Ladies Professional Golf Association. This isn't even a good general knowledge game. The questions are so America-centric. My British ass was in minus figures half the time. From time to time, you play a minigame. Alright, we gotta avoid the holes, rocks, and animals. We have avoided the holes, rocks, and animals. Press X at the right time. Hooray! In single player, they don't give you enemy AI here. So there's no gameplay. Are you shitting me? In fact, that applies to the entire game. Here is a complete playthrough of the game where I never touch my controller other than to close menus. I ended in minus figures and was declared a questionnaire mastermind. May the farts be with you. Okay, South Park Rally. It's even worse! Now the thing I love the most about this game is the sound I design. audio the overrated in this game not so like crash and Alright, well that did nothing. Alright, well that did nothing. Alright, well that did nothing. Oh no, there's... A oh, very small mark on my screen. I just can't see anything now. There's no way I could possibly. The game isn't just racing, though. You pick up where the last guy left off and cross the checkpoints in order. Player you know, I was just saying how I love loud fucking trains. This is the least amount of fun I've ever had with a video game. So you grab the trophy, then take it to the four checkpoints. Except of course, you're constantly hit by random off-screen items no matter how well you play, so lose the trophy. 
If someone else has the trophy, you can swipe it from them by bumping them with your vehicle. Oh, so like this. No? Oh, there we go! No? And just like that, I hit him so hard I launched. I'm literally inside them. Pinball! It's... It's Pinball. The soundtrack is just the composer taking the theme song and then having a fucking stroke. I love how half of the board graphics is just character JPEGs randomly smacked everywhere. My first NFT, ladies and gentlemen. $95. Phone Destroyer. A card strategy game. Put your tanks down to absorb the damage, then your archers to attack from a distance, then pile on some swordsmen because there's almost no penalty for doing so. Do this every single battle. Strategy game. How are the cards, at least? I just got Pigeon Gang. A gang of pigeons. Uh oh! Did someone call for Youth Pastor Craig? I'm not sure what to say, new kid. That was supposed to be an auto win battle, and you somehow failed. I do like how everything is presented as a smartphone game. All the characters talk to you via text message. Jimmy stutters in his text? Like, he goes through the extra effort of typing out the hyphens and extra letters and stuff? CONCLUSION! Just watch Family Guy at this point. No wonder these robots are so weak, it says Made in South Park on them. No wonder these robots are so weak, it says Made in South Park on them. No wonder these robots are so weak, no wonder these robots are so weak, no wonder these robots are so weak, it says Made in South Park on them. It says Made in South Park on them. It says Made in South Park on them. No wonder these robots are so weak, no wonder these robots are so weak.